everybody welcome to soar from home thursday it is me lindsay behind the camera but what you guys are looking at is our tadpoles we caught them this past weekend they are from our pond in our backyard we get a lot of tadpoles in the spring but not many of them make them to frogs they get eaten by the various animals um or just don't make it that's you know the life cycle but we wanted to give some tadpoles a chance so we have about 25 in here it's kind of hard to count them they move a lot as you guys can tell and even when you go to count them one always moves right now they're at the stage they just have a head and a tail soon they'll be getting legs uh, they eat the algae that's just in the water, but they're also snacking on the leaves. So you guys can see the holes in the leaves right here. That's because they're snacking on it. We change out their water and the plants. Uh, we go to the pond in our backyard and get them new stuff to eat on every couple days. But we have not named them. So I thought of a really fun idea. So Connor, you guys know Connor. He's my son. He is obsessed with naming everything with a C, like his name. And he loves the fact that our dog Cosette starts with C-O, just like he is C-O Connor. So we are gonna do a name generation, or generator. And how it's gonna work is I have two lists. I have a boy list and a girl list, and we're gonna try to evenly spread 25. I mean, obviously one is gonna have more, and I have a number generator. And so how it's gonna work is I've got my computer right here. I'm put you guys on it. I'll set you up best I can. And we're gonna generate a number. We'll pick, we'll go back and forth between boy and girl. And then we will just keep picking names until we go off. If we get the same number for the same, uh, gender a couple times then i will will generate a number again or i guess we could have the same name twice i like the same name twice connor's not opposed to that he often names a lot of things connor we have a lot of stuffed animals named connor i can't keep track of them so right now we're going to generate our first number 42 should we go girl or boy first let's do let's do girl first all right, now these are in sets of three. Yes, I'm using Disney, but so we're gonna go three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 7, 30, 3, 6, 9, 42. Cairo. Okay, so our first girl tadpole is Cairo. That is cool. And it says it means the, it's for the name of, uh, Cairo is the place name for the capital of Egypt, but the, we're gonna use it as a name. That's fun. All right, so we got our first name. Let's go. 38, and we did girl last, so let's do boy. And I know the screen makes it look really bad on the camera. I'm sorry. Oops, I forgot to start counting. We're going to go three. If you guys haven't figured out, I'm just counting by threes because they're in sets of three. So we're on 21 and Clark. Four, 28. What number did we want again? Lizzie forgot, 38. We're going to do this quick, quick, quick. Chandler. Oh, it's a candle maker. So Chandler the tadpole, you got to work on your candle making skills. Does anybody watch Friends? I did not know that. Apparently Chandler and Friends needed to make candles. 44. Oh, so that'll be easy because we know that we were on Cairo and that was 42. So we just got a two up from Cairo. Katie. Katie, that is an interesting spelling of Katie. So tadpole three is a girl named Cairo or Katie. I'm sorry. 
So we've got three tadpoles named now. Let's go back to boy, 43. And we know we are at 38 with Chandler, so we're gonna go nine, 40, 41, 42, 43. Cassius, ooh, that is a good name. Um, It says, Vane. Well, that's not necessarily the greatest uh, meaning for that name, but it says a name recognized worldwide as belonging to the great boxer Cassius Clay, most uh, now known as Muhammad Ali. So we've got our fourth tadpole. You guys, we're just bumping along in this. Let's find another one. All right, we're going to go for a girl, the number 13. So we need to go back all the way to the top. We're going to go four down and then one over. Celeste. Okay, meaning heavenly. That's a nice name. So Celeste is number five. Let's go 34. All right, boys want to stay all the same. So this is 43. We know this was 38. So we're going to go four back. I'm doing my maths. Eight, six, 35, 34. Chase. Who means a huntsman? That makes sense. They want to chase things. All right. I want to know who said they're not going to use math when they're older because I just use accounting right now. Okay. Four for girls. Let's see. What's number four? Let's go Caroline. Oh, the name Caroline possesses royal connotations. Uh, the Prince of Camelot, JFK, naming his daughter Caroline, and then it has more. But, okay, Caroline, that's our number. Where are we at? That's number five, six? Wait. I don't know where we're at. I'm going to figure it out. 22 for boys' names. So this is 34. I might just have to go back to the start. One, two, ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Connor with one N. My Connor spells it with two N's, but with an O-R. So that is our tadpole named Connor. They'll just spell it differently. Okay, I think we're on uh, nine. 16, 16 for a girl's name. If I'm wrong, it's okay. We can always pick more later. Okay, so for girls' names, we're on 16, so we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, because that's 15, 16. Cecilia. All right. Oh, she's uh, Saint Cecilia is the patron saint of music. Uh, and she was blind and a talented musician. Okay, a Swedish origin. origin. All right, hi, Cecilia. Number 10 with the boys, 38. We already did 38, so we're gonna go 35. And we know 38 is Chandler, which we need to find. I don't know if I just didn't go far enough, or if I went too far. What do you guys think? I think I went too far. I go way back up to the top. Ah, no, this part's gonna be so long because I can't find it. Okay, one, two. Okay, maybe I just give up on that one. Huh, I don't know where I went, guys. We'll have to go back up and count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, three, four. Cecile. Okay, Cecil, maybe. All right, number 10 is Cecil. I don't know what happened. Oh, you know what? I think we're maybe a different number. 18 for the girls. Did we already do 18? I don't think we did. 
let's try to go a little bit faster. One, two, three, four, five, six times three is 18. Caitlin. Hi, Caitlin. Just says Irish origin. All right. Let's do number 12. Is going to be number 14 for the boys. All right. We're going to go. One, two, three, four, five. Chad. Okay, so it means warrior. All right, that's cool. Oh, surnames of Chadwick and Chadwell. That's kind of cool. All right, let's go 13. Then we'll be halfway there. Number 10 for girls. We just had number... 14, right? Okay, so we gotta go one, two, three. That's nine, ten. Wait, we already had. Wait a minute, we already had ten. Oh no, we didn't. I went too far. It's Chelsea. It's a seaport and it means landing place for limestone. Okay. Tadpole Chelsea, you are a landing place for limestone, but maybe no li limestone should land on you. All right, 14 over halfway, 16 for the boys. Let's see, what's 16? Going to the top, we gotta count for the boys. One, two, three, four, times three is 12, five is 15, 16. Carson, son of a marsh dweller. You know, I think that's the most appropriate tadpole name and information yet because frogs would be a marsh dweller, right? 15 for the girls, 36. Oop, that just moved down. Let's see. One, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten times three is 30. So that's 33 is Candace and 36 is Colette. Oh, that's pretty close to Cosette, but we're gonna go with Colette. So Colette, um, it says along with names like Babette and Nanette, Colette was along among the et names, naming trend that was popular in the 1950s. Okay, so that's kind of an interesting insight. And 16, we're getting so close. Have we done number six? We just did 16. Okay, 16 got 16. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We just did 16. Oh, no, wait. I said six. Hold on. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we already did 16. Oh, that would have been so good that number 16 had generated number 16. Number one. We haven't gotten number one yet. Let's see, what was number one? I haven't even looked. Christopher. He's the patron saint of travelers. And he's Winnie the Pooh, Christopher Robin. So number 16 is Christopher. What's your favorite name so far? Let, let me know in the comments at the end what your favorite numbers uh, name has been. Number 13 for the 17th tadpole is... One, two, three, four. I got lost count. Who else lost count? Just me? It's okay. It's kind of hard to do this and film. One, two, three, four. It's 12 and then 13. Did it say 13? Okay. Celeste. Oh, because we had Cecilia, but I don't think we've had Celeste yet. So. Celeste, no, we've had Celeste because it means heavenly. So we need to do another number. All right, number 17 is not Celeste. It's gonna be 32. All right, so that's 13. This is 15, 16, or not 16, 18. Colleen, Colleen. All right, 17 is going to be Colleen. We're going for a boy, na boy name now. 25. Oh, it's all 25. Let's see. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 
Connor. I feel like we've had, we've had Connor already. Oh, well, it means wolf lover. That's interesting. Nine. I feel like these names are moving on me. Don't you guys? Let's go. Shall we do... How about we do Connor the second? Oh, that's why there's multiple Connors. We're going to do Connor the second for number 18. Then we're going to switch to a boy for number nine. One, or, and we'll go. And then for our 19th fish is Carlos. Carlos just is Spanish origin. But all right. Let's do... A girl, we'll do two girls' names in a row because we did that. So we want 29 and 19 for girls' names. One, whoop, 29 and 19. So we'll go probably fine. One, two, three, four, five, six times three is 18. So we want 19. So 19 is Carmen. Oh, which means beautiful, exotic, and lyrical. That's a nice name. So that's number 20. And then 29. So that's 19. So it's 21. 24, 27, 29 is Cassie. So that is awesome. So we've got, you guys, we're so close. That's 21. Oh my goodness. Let's do 22. We've got three left. Are you still with me for three more? Do you guys think this is a fun video to name all of the fish? 11. Or do you guys think this is really weird? One, two, three. Four is 12. Carter. Oh, Carter drives a cart. It's from a surname and an occupational name. That's kind of interesting. I never thought about that, but that makes sense. It's cart -er. It's like a verb. 11. All right. So that was number 22. <sighs> and then, oh my gosh, did you guys see that? We're doing number 23 and it generated number 23. I feel like the computer can hear me sometimes. It's a little scary. All right. We're going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 23 is Clara. I like the name Clara. That one's cute. 23, you're Clara. Two more names. Ooh, number one. We did number one boy. So how about we use this one for a girl and we'll do the last one a boy. And we do end up having like two more girls than boys, but that's okay. We don't really know their genders anyways. Chloe. Chloe, you're number 24. And then let's see, number 25. Boys, did we use number 12? Let's see, our last tadpole is... Colin. Oh my gosh, that was so much fun. Now all of our tadpoles have names. Hopefully they'll learn their names. I don't know if they can hear me saying their names, but that's kind of fun. All right, everyone have a great Thursday. Bye.